Hello, and thank you for viewing our demonstration video for Soapware. Soapware is a meaningful use certified and fully customizable electronic medical record that includes many features for daily practice workflows. These features include our scheduling workspace, e-prescribing, order entry to place, manage, and track laboratory and radiology orders, health maintenance, document and task management, a fully integrated practice management system, and so much more. Soapware includes a complete solution for patient care coordination using a patient portal known as MyHealthware. MyHealthware is a robust care coordination solution that provides practices with the tools and resources to share and view patient data and connect with healthcare colleagues and facilities. This allows you to coordinate with internal and external team members and to communicate with patients using secure electronic messaging. In addition, Soapware is ready to meet your needs for ICD-10. With Soapware's unique approach to ICD-10, you don't have to start with a blank slate. Let's get started by opening a patient chart using the Chart Rack Docked tab located at the bottom of the screen. This allows us to view the patient's health summary section, shown on the left side of the screen, as well as their list of encounter notes, or SOAP notes, on the right side of the screen. Notice the My Healthware icon located in the bottom left corner of the chart tab. The status symbol shown on this icon indicates that the patient is connected to the clinic through My Healthware. The patient is able to view their medical summary as well as receive secure electronic messages from the clinic. If the patient is not connected, Soapware allows you to easily click on the icon and choose to send the patient a My Healthware invitation via email, text message, or voice prompt on the patient's landline phone number. Let's review the patient's summary and make sure everything is updated with the information presented during today's visit. To calculate for required meaningful use objectives, certain fields must contain smart text items. Exclusive to Soapware, smart text is the backbone for our medical documentation using our EHR. Smart text is structured data that includes all of the proper background coding to be computer readable and searchable information. Because these items contain much more data than free text, these entries make it possible for items used in documentation to have underlying relationships in the medical record. The fields to focus on for meaningful use in the summary are active problems, medications, allergies, family history, and the tobacco field. Looks like everything is up to date for this patient's visit, except for the tobacco field. To make sure this is documented properly, I'll enter the shortcut T-O-B-M-U and press the spacebar. Clicking the Smoking Status item displays a list of choices in the Smart Text Quick Access located on the right of the screen. The patient is a current smoker who started about five years ago, so I will click the onset date to 2010. I will also include an initial date of today's visit. If you have reached stage two of meaningful use, you will also need to document in the family history field using the shortcut code FHMU. I'll click on the family history pick list and select the appropriate status of at least one first degree relative. Next, we enter the vital sign readings. Click to open the vital signs chart section, then click the first green plus button. This adds a reading date and an empty column to enter today's vital sign readings. Required for meaningful use, we need to enter blood pressure, height, weight, and the BMI, which will automatically be calculated in the vital signs section. Now, in the soap notes chart section, we can go ahead and start the encounter note by clicking the green plus to create a docutainer for today's visit. When the Add Task window opens up, select Add so the clinician will know there is a soap note to complete and sign off. For this particular visit, we are going to quickly insert a documentation template, which would be typical for a patient with an upper respiratory infection. Next, we're going to add today's vital sign readings into the objective field by simply clicking on the icon to transfer these right into the soap note. For this patient, we'll select the symptoms of fever, headache, and cough to enter in the subjective field. Everything else documented in this field is appropriate for today's visit. In the objective field, we will need to change the lung and respiratory findings from no wheezing to wheezing. Then we can place the diagnosis of bronchitis in the assessment field. 
Notice that the bronchitis diagnosis we entered for the patient is a dual-coded ICD-9-ICD-10 diagnosis. Soapware provides maximum ease by allowing you to enter the diagnosis that you are familiar with. The familiar ICD-9 diagnosis is dual-coded with an unspecific ICD-10 code whenever possible. From here, you may click on the ICD-10 sub-item, which will display a list of several related suggestions and general equivalent mapping ICD-10 codes on the right side of the chart. This allows you to choose and insert a more specific ICD-10 code as needed for the patient. Next, for this patient, we are going to order a chest x-ray that will be documented in the plan field using Order Manager. To access the Order Manager, click on the icon located in the common toolbar. Click on the Add New button to create a new order. Using chest as a keyword, we will select the appropriate x-ray from the different orders related to chest. Order Manager can also be used to place any referral orders. Today we want to refer this patient to a specialist. When clicking the Add New Order button using Pulmonologist as a keyword, we select Referral to Respiratory Physician. We can leave the performed date as the current day the order is placed. For meaningful use, we will send the care summary for the referral electronically through My Healthware. To do this, I click on the drop-down menu next to the My Healthware icon and select Care Summary. A new conversation with the care summary will be attached. In the To field, type the name of an outside provider who is connected through My Healthware. In the Message field, you may type the reason for the referral. Then click Send. For the chest x-ray, simply click Submit and the order will be documented in the plan field of our SOAP note. Now, in the Medications field, we need to place the prescriptions we'll be sending for this patient. Let's prescribe the antibiotic Leviquin and Prevental. Next, we open the Prescription Manager, select a pharmacy, and make sure the scripts are complete and correct before sending. We will click the Submit button to e-prescribe these prescriptions. Soapware also contains functionality to submit controlled medications using the Electronic Prescribing of Controlled Substances, or EPCS, feature. The EPCS feature is also certified to meet the requirements of iStop in the state of New York. Before we sign off the soap note for today's visit, let's take a look at the smart flow results for this patient. Smart flow results are soapware alerts related to clinical quality measures for meaningful use, CQMs. They are designed to remind and assist you when you are entering the appropriate codes for CQM calculations. For today's demonstration, Let's look at the measure of documentation of current medications. We performed this measure when we verified the medications in the patient summary with the patient today. To document that it has been performed, we click on the Action button. Notice that when this is now added in the Plan field, it shows that this has been performed today. To finish up this encounter, let's take a look at the Follow-up field and make sure it is filled out appropriately. If all documentation is complete and correct, we will be able to sign off the SOAP note. Since the patient is enrolled in My Healthware, signing off SOAPware will automatically provide a copy of the patient's medical summary in their My Healthware account as required for meaningful use. Let's open My Healthware and take a look at the features it provides for your patients. As mentioned, My Healthware allows your enrolled patients to view a snapshot of their medical history in their summary. This includes a list of their active problems, medications, lab results, care plan, and much more. My Healthware also provides you with the ability to enable secure messaging system so that your patients can send secure, HIPAA-compliant medical questions to the clinic via My Healthware. In addition, My Healthware allows patients to easily manage their health information, providing secure access to medical records, a safe portal for sharing information with family, and reliable messaging with everyone in their medical network. Thank you for viewing our Soapware demonstration. If you have any questions or would like a personalized live demonstration, please feel free to contact us. At Soapware, we are dedicated to improving the quality of ambulatory care and the satisfaction of physicians and their patients.